So as we're approaching these reefs, guys, and you're seeing them on your chart plotter, you know, one of the things you want to do is figure out, obviously, uh, you know, the stage of the tide and how your boat's going to drift across that piece of structure. Uh, you know, another reason why we, we, we put that track line on so you can kind of see how that previous drift was, um, you know, where your boat's going to kind of set up. Uh, but, you know, obviously why I always like to kind of keep my nose into the current uh, as much as possible. The boat just kind of drifts a whole lot nicer and then that allows you to work your baits off on a 45 degree angle and kind of get them to, to swing back into the tide. And that's kind of the key when you're working these, these structures is you want that bait to swing into that, you know, first couple of sets of, of, of waves on that structure and that's where those fish are positioned. They're going to be kind of, you know, sitting down there looking up for that bait to come washing over the top and if they're there, they're going to come up and eat. There he is. a boy, Neil. I'm on. Good eyes, Tom. Digging. Yeah. All right. There you go, huh? Yeah. How pretty that fish is.